Hello, this is Vern, and if you've ever wondered how to deepen the level of intimacy while having sex with your partner, you are in luck because that's what you and I will be expressing today. Hello, this is Vern. Welcome to your great life to be.com. Today is another edition of Get the Love You Crave, and today we're going to be discussing three immediate ways to deepen your level of intimacy when having sex. And here's the first one friendship goes before anything else. Uh, here's what I mean most partnerships, most human beings who want to deepen the level of intimacy, focus on technique or strategy or read a book on, on Tantra or something of that nature. Nothing wrong with any of those but that's not the thing that's gonna help you get the deepest level of connection with someone. The thing that will help you connect with human being at the deepest level where you can let go, surrender, be fully present, feel, seen, heard, loved, and embraced is deepening your level of friendship. So focus on that first. Focus on creating a connection with a human being where you can understand exactly what their inner world is like, where you can feel heard, where you can feel seen, where you can understand what someone's thinking and feeling. When you get to be next to a human being and you're, in, you're intensely feeling what they're feeling because you have such a deep level of friendship, then the sex part kind of takes care of its own. There's other things you can do to increase it, but that's the first one I start with. The second one is going to be speak your truth more consistently. Something that happens in life that prohibits human beings from expressing themselves in sex <laughs> is when things are going on in the world and you shut down, you don't speak your truth, you hold down little grudges, you stop closing your heart. And when you close your heart for, to avoid feeling pain, you close your heart to experience the deepest level of joy, intimacy, and expressiveness as well. So when you're a human being who can express her truth, when it's happening, while it's happening, or the closest possible to when something happens, the better you'll be able to release and let go because you trust the man you're with. When you don't let go and when you don't express the truth, then you hold on to your grudges, you put up walls, and you never surrender at the deepest level for him to go deeply into your heart and feel what you're feeling. Third and last way to deepen your level of intimacy is going to be embrace the range of light and darkness. What do I, the hell do I mean by this? Embrace your light and darkness means be willing to experience a full range of expressiveness. That includes speaking to your partner about your deepest desires and fantasies. It includes being willing to not do things the same way every single time. Be willing to, if you're a guy, be incredibly strong and present. If you're a woman, incredibly soft and sensual and surrendering at that level. When you can deepen into your masculine or your feminine, and experience that with someone, the polarity increases and the depth of feeling, if the other two items which we spoke about today are present, gets magnified significantly. So try this out in your life. If you're not with someone, I, my challenge is for you to be very conscious and aware of how this plays out when you enter your next relationship. If you are with someone, then use it today. So here's the thing. Uh, if you're not already on one of my lists, my email list that is, I want to right now, before you do anything else, sign up below. There's a link below where you can click on and get one of my free video programs that's gonna take you through an, an entire journey of how to go from being afraid to connecting to the man of your dreams. So do that right now. If you're watching me on YouTube or uh, simply click like uh, on my video, subscribe to my channel so you never miss an episode. And at the same time, write a comment below and let me know what is the biggest takeaway you have from this video. Thank you so much for allowing me to share this with you. As always, I challenge you to live a full and a conscious life.